a lot of you may not know about it. Hello, this is BJ from Hearns Hobbies and today I'm gonna to have another glue trick for you, which has got to do with these Tamiya Extra Thin Cements. Now, if you do like this, please give me a like on the bottom. That would be really helpful. And if you'd like to see more of these sort of videos, please subscribe and you'll see a new video every day. Now with these particular glues, the little trick I have is a really simple and somewhat obvious one, but a lot of you may not know about it. It's a bit like the Tamiya uh, tape trick. Now, if you look at the overhead, I've got the two extra thin cements. Okay, so it's the extra thin cements which it will work with. And this has to do with the brush that, which is inside. Now, let me see. Now, if I open these like this, it's all gonna spill out. So let's just put them upright. Okay, and I'll take the, the brushes off each one of these. Okay, so they've got the super fine brushes. So we've got the two different greens here. It doesn't really matter. It just means that this is their standard extra thin and this is the extra thin quick dry. They do have the same brushes. Actually, if I had a black background here, it'd probably be better. Let's get this here. This will be easier for you to see. All right, let's do this. All right, so we are glues back. Hopefully you can see, oh, much better. Okay, so they've got the super thin brushes in them. Now, what you will probably don't know until you actually use a lot of the glue is the brush is reaches well, probably about three mil before the bottom of the jar, which means you're gonna have a thin amount of glue still there and you won't be able to reach it with this particular brush. But there is a way of extending the brush, which you may not know. Okay, so with these, they are pressure fit into the cap. You can just pull these off. You see there's a, a little, or well, a pretty long nipple actually in there. And then you see how this is actually stepped. Okay, now if I do a bit of a zoom, let's see if I can zoom this so you can see it better. Oh, where am I? There we go. So you see the step right there? And this is where we're going to extend it. So all I'm gonna do is I've got a pair of pliers here, like this. And I'm gonna grab the tip here. Now usually they're pretty loose. You see how it came out? So there will be a rib that locks into a recess. Okay, so you see how it's quite loose there. And if we just push it in until it's just a little bit tight, it's already extended quite a bit. Now, I'll let you see, this is with it locked in as original. And then when you release it, it comes out like this. And if I compare it to the other one, you'll see the difference that it makes. Okay, and just with that short extension, that's gonna allow you to reach the very bottom of the jar. Now what you might find is this one was pretty easy to remove. Occasionally they can be a bit tight. So if it is tight, you'll just need a little bit more effort and it just needs the end part, like this bit, just pulled out a little bit. So you see that? It's not a big difference, but it makes all the difference. And that's it. That is my very simple tutorial on the brushes for the Tamiya Extra Thin Cements. So just by extending the little tip, it'll be well, it'll allow you to use all your glue without using a separate brush. So that's it. Thank you for watching.